and give me a thumbs up. Thanks a lot. Go ahead and subscribe if you'd like to as well too. Today I'm going to show you the heating and air conditioning controls on the 2017 GMC Yukon, okay? So I'm going to start from the left, okay? So right here you have the knob for controlling the temperature. As you can see, I go left, it makes it cooler. I go right, it makes it warmer, okay? Right here, there's an auto feature which will turn the uh, the unit on onto auto, autopilot right there. I press that and it turns on auto, okay? I can press it again, it won't turn it off. It'll only turn off like once I turn down the fan speed, okay? We'll get to the fan speed in a second, okay? Right here is the AC button. If you have the fan uh, or the temperature on cold, uh, it's gonna blow cooler air, but if you want air conditioned air, you make sure that that's pressed right here for the air conditioner, okay? Right here is the recirculation mode. If you wanna recirculate the air within the vehicle, press that, okay, and it recirculates the air, okay? Right here, we have the face blowing directional uh, airflow, okay? I press that, it blows at the face. Press down there, it blow, blows at the feet. Right here, we have the controls for the fan speed. If I go right, it turns the fan speed high, counterclockwise fan speed low and then if I press this button in the center it turns it off okay so we're gonna turn it back on but pressing it right there all right so and then right here we have defroster mode okay defroster and feet so it blows at the defrost defrost the windshield and blows at the feet blows at the face and feet blows at the windshield for defrosting and then right there defrost is the rear windshield okay and then we also have the passenger temperature the passenger temperature can be totally different okay so i can adjust that right there and if i want to sync both the uh temperatures on both the passenger and driver side i'm just going to press sync and it takes the temperature back to uh everyone has the same temperature then there's also a little bit more to it there is a rear climate control okay so that you can turn the rear climate control on by pressing the power button okay and then there gives you an option right here for fan speed in the rear directional of where you want the air to blow on the uh, uh passengers in the back and then you can actually change the temperature for the people in the back as well too all right, and then there's a rear climate control lock to where it can be adjusted. Okay. Okay, there's a lock, rear climate control lock, and then there's the auto feature right there. Okay. Now give me a thumbs up. Thanks a lot for watching. Let me know if you have any questions.